Hello, welcome to this lecture. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you extract and the method and the predefined function for to extracting the parameter like a year, like current stamp is having date, year, and month. And similarly, we have like these three different parameters are grouping at the same level. And for any instance, I want only one year parameters like a four digits of year code only I require. What I want to do? How I can use by using the SQL query statement only, how can I get it? Yes, there is an, a wonderful and beautification of the functionality ready-madely which is available in Microsoft SQL Server. It is function to extract the year from a date. You can use the year method or date part to using these methods, we can get it is in a, the particular using the keyword to the data like a year part only, we'll get it and we'll use that uh, as our parameter from the requirement. Okay, first we'll see in this scenario, in our previous lecture, we have seen how to create date timestamp by default itself, how it will be created in the SQL Server while the data records inserted into the database. In this section, completely we'll observe and we'll see here like uh, extracting, which is already inserted the data of the current timestamp. Okay, for an instance of an example, the functionality of this. Like a see here, like a year and a year method within the year met method, I'm writing like current timestamp and terminate execute. You'll see here the current timestamp will say today's date and time. And this is the year is extracting from this current timestamp. The output it is showing it's in a no column name and 2020, the year. As an alias name, I take in and year I can take it. Now see here, like uh, year one, I can specify. Otherwise, it won't match there. Yes. Now see year one. You see it is our uh, financial year. I can say that. Now see here the output. It is a twenty twenty year only. It is getting. Similarly, in advanced only, if you want to get month, simply type it as in a month. That's it. Financial year it is instead of year you can make it as in a month here That's it the column title will change automatically the sixth month and the day from this how it is Simply type it is in a day. That's it and the name it is in a financial day over How beauty the functionality which is already used and ready-madely it's available in MSQL more like a, a MS SQL server I hope you better understand about this and more advantageously you see here by using one more method it is there for like a date part how can you use the date part here yes see part here it is coming and from this let's mention the year comma the current Timestamp. Let's see here. Execute. You, you will get the same thing. For get fire alias name. Function in financial year. That's it. Refresh and reload. You get in a year. As you see in this, very simple. Okay. Now, I would like to see you like uh, what we have uh, created on a shopping table. From that current timestamp, I want to show you that it's in a demonstration. Let's see how it is. Select like a year, year in the parenthesis. I'll write it probably from shopping, the name of the table. Okay. In between the year, the name of the column, order, let's go date. That's it. Execute. Have you seen this? This table is having here only the table. This table is having all about uh, seven rows. 
seven data rows I am getting the result set of seven years here. How much I want to take as a data of the current year, I can get easily by writing like this. Name of the column we have to specify within the method of a year function. And there we can using from, you know, that what is the purpose of from, and from where we are getting the data of the database table, name of the table here we have a specified, and a column here gives the column. We have implemented the select statement for extracting only the year only likewise you apply many like year month day hours minutes seconds all you try to apply and you will get as in how to use this built-in extract methods of mysql like ms sql server but only this a very slight differences it may be in mysql and most of the relational databases management systems will support and uh, such all the facilities are having these type of databases. Okay. Thank you for watching this session. Thank you.